Hi, and welcome to your Salmon Arms Silverbacks Game Day Preview presented by The Woodshop for Saturday, April 3rd. Tonight, your Silverbacks will take on the West Kelowna Warriors, the first meeting between the two teams of the 2020-21 regular season. It's the first game of the season for the Warriors as they did not play yesterday. Your backs are coming off a 4-1 defeat at the hands of the Vernon Vipers in last night's season opener. And let's start there by recapping last night's game. The backs opened the scoring, actually, just 2.15 into the game. Surprise, surprise, Drew Bennett, Johnny on the spot as he potted home a ricocheted shot. Tucker Hartman's point shot missed the net, but there was Bennett to open the scoring just a couple of minutes in. The Vipers responded not long after, tying the game at 1-1 on a power play, and then they did score with just over three minutes remaining in the first period to take a 2-1 lead into the intermission. Unfortunately, it was the Vipers' power play again that made the difference early in the third, making it 3-1 and then 4-1, a goal late from Jack Glenn to put the game out of reach. The backs did outshoot Vernon 33-26. They did uh, outplay them at 5-on-5. Five five. It really was a special teams that was the difference. In fact, assistant coach Carter Cochran said there were lots of positives to build off from Friday's game. I thought we were overall pretty happy with the way we played last night. Um, know that we're, I mean, we generated 10 chances for and only got one goal. And, um, you know, if we out continue to outchance teams and outshoot teams and play it the structured way that we want to play. We think that we're creating a recipe for success. Now the backs taking on West Kelowna tonight, a very different looking team on paper. Over 10 players who played for them in the exhibition season are no longer on the roster. And there are some big names, no Matthew Steinberg, no Jack Finley, uh, no John Evans, no Charles Alexis Legault. So there are some big losses for West Kelowna. But as usual, assistant coach Carter Crockett says the focus for the Silverbacks is on themselves heading into tonight's game. Well, you know, West Kelowna plays a very different style than Vernon, and uh, we're really focused on making the style that the Salmon Arm Silverbacks play one that other teams have to adapt to. So we're going to be focused on us for today and uh, make a few tweaks from last night, but we're excited to get back out there again. Last thing here with a game day preview is your Twin Anchors Silverback player to watch for tonight. And I'm going to go with Will Levine. Levine played tremendous yesterday. Just so smooth, calm, cool, and collected with the puck. So Levine, a very strong game on the back end for the Silverbacks yesterday. He's one of four rookie defensemen for the Silverbacks. Really, the whole back end was strong yesterday. How to tune in tonight? It's a 6 o'clock puck drop. We will be on the air starting at 5.45 on BCHL TV. That's where you can catch all the action. All the action all season 